Welcome back everyone to episode three and let's see how we're doing against COVID. So, so far there's been five, there's five active cases, uh, still zero deaths at this time and 13 people recovered. So Let's look at our protective equipment and stock. Um, okay, ICU beds are still pretty good. We have 320 million tests coming in. Medical respirators is 246. And for the general public, I have 192 million with another 80 million on order. So let's get a little more strict to see what happens. And we're still just going to confine it to the contaminated states. And let's see. So I'm going to construct a temporary hospital. And I'm going to place that in New York. Since that was hit the, one of the hardest uh, during this pandemic. And we'll just put it right there. And that's going to give us 800 more uh, ICU beds just in case. Okay, a thousand people, I'm not going to worry about that at all. All right, let's look at our energy. Okay, we have a 455 terawatt surplus. So we need to use some of that up. Um, Let's start that with electric vehicles. All right, we're already doing well with that. Okay, electrical materials. So let's put about 5 billion into that. See, it didn't go up that much, but it's still progress. All right, and let's see here. So let's build a few more shale oil wells in Georgia.
Okay, so let's start in Georgia. Okay, so that's very good. Um, let's do about four more. Let's just double check to make sure there aren't any. Nope. It's just the ones that I'm building. So that's pretty good. All right. And we're going to do one more for, for Georgia. Eh, let's just accept. I know they're not going to get in anyway. All right, so let's look at our secret service and terrorist groups. Okay, so all these people need to be put under surveillance. We have more agents and we're going to put them in. Let's put them in Iran. And we're going to bump up our research. Depending on how much money it's going to cost us. So we're going to invest 2.6 billion into food. Okay, for cereals, I'm going to invest another 10 billion into that. And then let's look at our water networks. All right, so we need to bump that up. Let's, uh, let's give it about 5 billion more. And education, we're going to increase. Put 
just make that small investment for now. Growth really took a dive. All right, let's see. What else can we... Okay, let's put about two billion into that. Okay. All right, so let's take a look at our COVID crisis. All right, so now it's spread to the two other states. Idaho and Oregon. So let's see what we can do. Okay, so let's do a control lockdown. And we're still just going to do the contaminated states. Want to slow down our economy implosion that's going to happen any anyway regardless. All right, travel. I don't think it needs to be that strict just yet. All right. Let's do the tracking, but we'll make that optional. All right, and in the meantime, we can still improve uh, infrastructure. So it's going to cost 30. Okay, so let's. Actually, yeah, you know what? Yeah, let's just make it 93. And then, so New York, you want to bring that to about, we'll bring that to about 40. I'm going to do the large states first. We're the ones that's going to be heavily hit. Um, let's do that for now. 
ですね。Wow, New Jersey is really up there. So let's get them to about 80. And Pennsylvania. Keep them at about forty. So overall, this should help the economy a little bit. And housing. Do about twenty thousand. All right. All right, so hopefully these things will help slow down the、uh, the spread. And let's see, still have an excess of twenty point two two. And let's invest that. Okay, so this is already helping with medicine. Let's do about a one percent tax cut. Let's authorize referendums. All right, so that tax cut is actually going to help our economy. Let's look at our inflation. All right, so I'm only going to invest in health research and education during the、uh, during the the pandemic. So. All right, that was a little bit. All right, let's see how this. Okay, spread to New York now. So I think I'm gonna. Get a little more strict with、uh, public transport. And. 
Okay, so, so far, so good. We're... In terms of the economy, we have a... $3 trillion excess. Uh, 22.39% structural surplus. So, we're not really hurting for money just yet. And our growth is starting to go up a little bit, not by much. So let's bump up our cybersecurity. Hey, it looks like we completely uh, got rid of the Italian Mafia. Alright, so we have 31 more agents. We're going to put them in Pakistan. And out of curiosity, I want to see... Okay, China's already recovering. All right, so how is their economy being affected? They're still doing better than us in terms of growth. But national deficit, we're still doing better. All right, and I think I'm going to end episode three. And just stay tuned for episode four. Thanks again for the support and see you soon.